RB Battles decided to give out more gold crowns, a cat Dominus was uploaded, and Minitune took over the Roblox Twitter. All of that and more will be explored in today's video. Welcome to the first episode of Weekly Roblox News, your source for all the Roblox news that happened last week. Let's get straight into it. On Sunday, a change was made to the RB Battles final battle. Checkpoints were added when it was released, but upon leaving or disconnecting, you would lose your checkpoint and have to restart the whole final battle. The change they made improved the checkpoint feature. Now if you had a previous checkpoint, you could spawn there even if you exited the game. I personally don't do the RB Battles events, but even I understand how helpful this is. The next piece of news is also related to RB Battles, and also happened on Sunday. On Twitter, the official RB Battles Twitter account posted a poll that read, There was an issue last night that sometimes caused crowns to not be awarded. It should be fixed now, but all gold crowns are claimed. Should we make it fair by resetting everyone's checkpoints and increasing the time limit to 15k? And then in parentheses, you would have to complete it again. A majority of people actually voted to resetting everyone's progress and upping the number of golden crowns to 15k. If you're wondering when they reset everyone's progress, it probably happened yesterday on the 4th according to this screenshot. Nothing happened. Literally nothing happened. On Tuesday, the minimum amount of Robux needed to DevX was lowered from 50,000 to 30,000. If you don't know what DevXing is, it's basically how you convert the Robux you've earned from games and other forms of monetization on Roblox into real life money. This update is super helpful for a lot of small game creators on Roblox. I really hope this is a sign that Roblox will change the exchange rate because the ex current exchange rate is extremely low. For example, if you DevX 30,000 Robux, you will get $105, which is not an extremely small amount of money. But if you were to buy 30,000 Robux, you would have to spend around 300 US dollars. On Tuesday, we also got a confirmed date of when the gold crowns limit will be raised to 15,000 for the RB Battles event. The RB Battles Twitter account tweeted a tweet that read, On Saturday, the cap for gold crowns will be raised. Anyone who doesn't have one gets one last chance. Anti-cheat is enabled, so no cheating. There will be a prompt to opt in to start over for a chance at the gold crown but if not interested, you can continue for the regular one. So this confirms what I said earlier in the video. The 4th of February was when they reset everyone's progress and gave everyone the chance to get one of the last 5,000 crowns. On Wednesday, nothing big happened, but I did manage to find two small things that are both equally interesting. First one is the Cat Dominus. This item is obviously inspired by the Dominus series, and I think they did a great job making it. If you would like to buy it, the link will be in the description of this video. The second small piece of news is a video posted by Colton Rao, I think is how you pronounce it, on Reddit. They made a song completely out of sounds from the game Doors. I'll play a little bit here for you now, but I recommend you listen to the full thing. The link of, to the video will be in the description. If you want to hear more, go look in the description. Well, that's it for Wednesday. See you on Thursday. Just like on Wednesday, nothing really happened on Thursday. But I did find this cool collection of UGC items. It's called the Crown of Valentine Collection. And the link to buy them will be in the description. I really like when UGC creators make creative items like this instead of just the dumb stuff you see posted every now and then. Well, that stuff is funny. I do like it more when UGC creators post stuff like this. 
On Friday, Minitune, the creator of Piggy, took over the Roblox Twitter account and posted a total of six tweets. I think that this is the second time Roblox has had someone take over their Twitter account. And I think that they should continue doing this because it's a good way for them to interact with the community. Tell me what you think about this in the comments, but I can only see positives coming from them doing this more. On Saturday, Roblox hit a new record for the most active players on Roblox at once. About 9.3 million people were playing at the same time. To put that into perspective, more people were playing at one time than the current population of Austria. A few hours later, Roblox crashed, but it wouldn't be a Saturday on Roblox without that happening. Well, that's about all the news I have. Thank you for watching, and I hope you watch the next video in the series. It will be uploaded exactly one week from now. Bye. Thank you for watching.